Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So I've seen a couple simmers do this now. Uh, Little Simsy, The Sim Supply, and The Illigracy have all been doing this. And so I decided I'm going to do like a take on it. It's not going to be so much a less build. It's going to be kind of like a how to build or building tutorial. Um, I'm not the best builder. Um, and I honestly did not build until I got the Sims 4. So I'm gonna just start building using this basic boss tool. You just, you pull it out, you make a boss. Alright, so. Using the basic boss tool, I'm gonna start building a shell. Now you could leave it there and just have like an L-shaped house, but I like to do a little more. I like to spoof it up some. So I'm going to rotate to the back. I'm going to do some like bump outs. I think I'll do one like this. And then we can have a back porch. And maybe like... But this is looking kind of... You know what? We're just going to... have issues there. Okay, we'll do it like this. Maybe like that. Um, maybe I'll do like a little um, bay window here. I'll show you how the roof's added too. And then I like to pull out this little jingy bob. And we'll make a back porch. And then we'll come around the front. And we'll slap one on here. And then I want to give it a foundation. So I'm just going to click on and just drag it up. Maybe a little more than that. I like about three stairs. So um, Sometimes I struggle with picking stuff. I'm very indecisive. I'm going to just grab these. If I don't like them, I'll change them later. Okay, so my reference picture does not have a chimney, but I want to add a chimney just to spice it up, okay? We don't have to stick 100% to our reference pictures. Plus, you can't really... In The Sims, you can't really do that that well. Uh, maybe it's taller. So with the half walls to do a boss, you want to make sure you have this selected and then you can just make a boss. We'll see how that works for now. Uh, copy the stairs. Yeah, I think that's going to be good. Okay. Um, all right. So. Now I'm going to start with the Rufin. Rufin, I'm not going to lie, can sometimes be like the bane of my assistance in The Sims 4. I've actually rage quit the game, not been able to get Rufin right, so. Let me reference my picture. Okay, so then I have another one of these. But that way. I don't like this bit here. Let's lower this down. Okay, and then we're gonna get one of these roofs. What is this? A half gabled roof? That's a gabled roof. And you know what? Before I put that down, I'm gonna grab this. That's too far out. Okay, that's good. Maybe. No, okay. Uh, then we'll get the roof. Put it down. I kind of want to even it with that. Like that. Uh, but then I still don't like this. Can I... 
Um, you know what we're gonna do? I'm just gonna put that over there. Slap that back on top. I'm gonna move the house over a little bit this way. Okay, I'm gonna extend this a little more. I don't know how I feel about that, but whatever. It's whatever. And then we'll move this back. Oh. I don't know what my screen just did there. Okay, I still, I'm still iffy about this, but we'll work on it. I'm gonna grab this octagon roof with the eight sides and I'm gonna slap it down right there. But I don't really like how it looks at this moment. So I'm gonna lower it down and I'm gonna pull out the eaves. I like that better. You know what, maybe if I lower this a bit, how's that look? Oh, this is sticking out though. Um, I'm gonna hold down shift and bring that in. Oh. Okay, I think that looks somewhat better. But then I'm going to grab another half. Oh, I'm jumping ahead of myself. I'm going to get one of these. Slap it down up here. Does that need to come out a little? Nope, that's good. Then we'll go back to the roof. Get the half ripped roof. And oops, I'll put it in like that, but then you have like this. So hold down shift again. Oh, that doesn't look the greatest. I don't like how it sticks out right there, but we'll have to do. That looks much better. And can I... Whoop. So the only thing is that bothers me a little bit, but I'll get over it. And then what I'd like to do is grab some columns. I like this one, this plain one from Get to Work. No. Uh, get together. Get to work, get together, get famous, get this, get that. The Sims has a habit. I didn't want to place it right there. Oh. But then I'll come around the back. Plop some down here too. And then I'll pick out some fencing. I'm gonna just go basic, very simple. Go back to the front. Slap some down there. Uh, then what I like to do is I like to um, click here and get these fireplace things. And we'll pick a fireplace. How's that one gonna look? Um, no, I don't like that one. Okay, so we'll do this one, but see, I don't like... And if you click this, you can just... You don't have to draw it, you can just like click on it and it will replace it. Okay, it's replaced on all sides. Now what's going on here? They just don't want to mash up now.
Nope. This is gonna be like uber annoying now. What if I, oh, hold on. Instead of doing a half gabled roof, what if I do this? Oh, you know what? Then we'll just... But then this becomes a problem, so... See what I mean by the roofing, guys? Okay. That's somewhat better. We're still gonna have, like, a little... But it does look better. Actually, I think I want to... Make the back the front and the front the back. Yeah. But let's get... And you know what? I'm going to change the fence because I'm not liking that one. I think I'm going to use this one. No. Okay, so I like that better. So now the shell of the house is pretty much done. The roofing is still kind of bleh, but I just don't feel like fussing with it. Actually, yeah, I think, how's that look in the back? Okay, I like that. So now I'm gonna put on some windows but and get a front door. So, picking doors sometimes. I like to try and match like the stairs are two by two, so I wanna get like a two by two door. Because I'm just picky like that. See, like that's a th I don't want that. Oh, maybe this one in white. And then windows. Oh, let's get a door for the back. I kind of want to do like a smaller back door, but I still kind of want it to have a window. There we go. And then I like to delete all the inner walls. And I'll figure that out later. I might just for the floor plan sakes, pull that out more. Then sometimes I like to go and get some of this. 
I don't know what color I'm gonna make the house yet though, so. It's gonna be a pain now. Uh, so what I gotta do is come back over here, grab this, and just bring it along the roof. Ceiling, roof ceiling, whatever you want to call this. That did not place in the right spot. There we go. Now I can come here, grab this. I think I'll stick with white for now, actually. I think it just goes around the whole thing now. So I'm gonna jump to windows now. And I think I wanna try and keep to like maybe base game and seasons. But I did use that from. So maybe I'll change that. Now I gotta pick a trim. This can take me a while too. I don't really like to use these ones because like it doesn't place like see how it will put that there but then like it's not there. And it should I feel like it should be on all of the corners if it's gonna be there at all. Do we want to do bricks? I'm not feeling it. Uh. Oh, that one has one of those. Never mind. Blue? No. Could go dark. I think I'm going to go with this color, though. And then you see here how this is still like, you just want to click on each roof. And then it's applied to the roofs. For like sometimes you can like do the roofs different and it looks good. But I'm going to just have the roofs match. And then I want to do brick for the fireplace. Or chimney, fireplace, same thing. How's this basic brick look? And then I think maybe I'll change this to like a gray. Same with this. And the fence, you gotta come in here and find like the fence that you used and I can't find, okay. no that's not, colors. Yeah, it has all kinds of filters here too that you can filter through so. But now, I'm just gonna replace those because I'm not liking how they look. The stairs can be replaced too. And then I'm gonna add a roof trim. You just want to go around, click all the roofs, it will add it. And then that half wall there, I want to add a trim. So you click that, then you can pick your color and whatnot. Gonna get some stairs back. I think I'll go with these ones. Get 
get a uh, a reel in. When you've already placed something down and you want to like say you like want to grab it again you can use this eyedropper tool and it will grab it for you let's move the house again so we can have more of a backyard I feel like it could use a bigger lot, truth be told. Oh, that's right. My gallery is broken. So I have to remove my mods to move stuff to upload anything. So I don't feel like doing that right now so okay and then I'm gonna pick a foundation um Again, I said I want to keep this base game and uh, season, so I don't know if I like the seasons with it. Yeah, I'm not really feeling it. I think I might do the chimney red. this no yeah no I'm gonna do it red and once again I'm going to change the stairs because I just I'm not feeling those stairs these ones feel like way too white I don't know oh I think I like that better yeah and then we gotta find some like flooring for do I have like a white floorboard in how's that gonna look um, I mean I don't know guys I'm so indecisive Oh, I didn't want to place that there. Oh, I like this one. Oh, and I like that it's like... Yeah, there we go. I think I don't want these windows anymore. See? Indecisive. Okay guys, so being the completely indecisive person that I am, I went and I changed the windows around and now I'm not liking this door. No. Okay, this door. So now I'm going like completely more base game. But that's okay. Now floor plans are a toughie for me. I hate doing floor plans. Uh... I'm gonna need a bathroom somewhere, so... Maybe that could be like a small little bathroom. Although I think this house is only gonna have one bathroom, so. 
Hmm. We're gonna need a bedroom. Oh, what did I do? Sometimes a good way to figure out how to make the bedroom is just pull out a bed. Then you can like determine the size of the bedroom. Like if you want to make this a two bedroom house, you could like So then, you could do bedroom, bedroom, bathroom, and then kitchen and dining could be like over here, and like. So bedroom, bedroom, bathroom, entryway, kitchen, slash dining, living room. Or you could just have kitchen, dining, living, all like open area. I think I'll do it like that. And then the kitchen, dining, and living will all be like... open okay so that's the shell and the floor plan I'm gonna leave this here and I will see you guys all next time